everybody this is Marley it's been a very long time since I've uh, been here on YouTube but life has been so busy and lots of things have happened and I didn't feel to create anything or um, yeah well I just couldn't find myself into crafting but lately I've made this um, suitcase and I posted it on my blog and Facebook and I got a lot of responses to it so I decided to make a video of it and come back to YouTube because I miss you guys so I hope you will enjoy this video and um, yeah this is um, a suitcase and I bought this suitcase uh, clear on a craft fair here in the Netherlands and I decorated it, uh, the whole thing with Prima Marketing Romance Novel Collection still my favorite collection of Prima and um, yeah get started in this corner here you can see I've used a cute little bird and um, lots and lots of flowers some homemade some roses some tools some from Prima marketing and here you can see some metal that I got from scrap unlimited it's a Dutch store here in the Netherlands lots of roses and I did lots of texturing so it's really hard to name all of the things here on um, my box here I've used um, bingo piece that says the number four and um, on the 4th of January Mr. Wilson is his birthday and inside this suitcase is a mini album with Wilson so I thought this number would uh, be fine on this here you can see some more flowers and another metal piece and these buttons here oh sorry it's not focusing right here I've used some buttons that are from a new um, Dutch company it's called Dutch Dubadu and uh, they create paper art and so I just colored it pink and put some glossy accents on them these cute little um, leaves here are from Dutch Dubadu too just like the swirl here you can see a little one peeking out so here is the cluster of flowers and all kinds of embellishments and um, here you can see I've used a ticket and a butterfly and here is a kind of a clock but you don't see it very well here I've used a chicken wire mask it's also from Dutch Dubadu here is another beautiful swirl and here are the edges of the suitcase here is also a zipper from Prima Marketing that says explore and here is some more masking with um, the chicken wire and the floral mask also from Dutch Dubadu here are some cutouts with an airplane and a feather that's a pen and here I got a metal plate that says life is not a destination but a journey and I've got this from a sweet friend here is the chicken wire mask again and the floral mask and on this corner I've used a wooden piece and I um, distressed it with some distress ink vintage photo here I cut out a butterfly and a pen nip from Tim Holtz and it says journal some postage stamps, a light bulb that says memories here are the leaves and the buttons from Dutch Dubadu again and some more tickets and swirls here is another cluster of flowers and here is a beautiful um, butterfly also from Dutch Dubadu a lovely key and all around the um, suitcase I've wrapped around some um, lace and you can pull it up and I've decorated the sides too also with the chicken wire mask and a floral mask and I put some gesso on it to accent the florals here is the chicken wire again lots and lots of texture hope you can see it well here is this other side and these papers are just amazing I just this is just my favorite collection 
of all times and I'm sorry if I missed anything from this box it's just full and full of um, of details I will go quickly over it so this is actually just um, just the box of the suitcase and I will open it now and I will put it um, here so you can see it better like this so this is the suitcase when it opens and let me zoom in oh and this one here has to turn around so here is the inside of the suitcase lots and lots of details too I've um, let me grab it actually so um, this is the inside and here is a little um, how do you call it compass <laughs> You know what I mean, this one here, and I let it hang down. And I've created a pocket right here with some lace and papers. And here is a little charm, let me see if I can grab it here. It's actually really difficult to film it. So here is a little charm with some roses, a clock and a key and some uh, binoculars that I also got from Scrap Unlimited so this is hanging down right here and in this pocket I've created some more journaling spots I will take them out in a moment here are some uh, bottles some of them are just perfume uh, perfume bottles and this one is empty and I created this um, with grunge board and some washi tape here is a film roll here you can see the bottles better. A film roll and a key. Here is a little pocket that opens. I will do that in a moment. And here is um, Elixir Magical po uh, Potion. And I thought that went w very well with the bottles. And this was pretty much um, this inside. And let me put it there so it will stand. And um, let me grab these pockets out of this one. So these all can come out. And um, they are here. So here is just a little journaling uh, spot that says it doesn't matter where you go, it's who's beside you. And here is some washi tape. Here is some more room. Um, for journaling also from the Prima Marketing collection and here I created this little um, well passport <laughs> it's quite funny actually I uh, this is just from the collection and I stamped all of it like uh, this is a stamp here is some washi tape some postage stamps um, here is the date that I made it some crackle stamps from Bo Bunny, some postage stamps again. I just stamped this whole thing to make it look like, uh, yeah, an old passport. So when you open it, yeah, it does, Mr. Wilson. <laughs> I thought this was a really uh, funny picture. We all look very, um, well, not saying ugly, but we don't look very nice on pictures that has to go on your driver's license or passport or something. So I thought this one was really uh, fun. <laughs> so, and here I just, um, this is actually a clear stamp from Prima Marketing and I cut out all those clear, because um, it was one piece, one alphabet. And I cut them all out and I placed them here. That says name Mr. Wilson, day of birth. It's the 4th of January 2011. And the sex is male. Uh, nationality, Bulgaria. The date that I made this. It was on um, uh, the 8th of September. And he loves to play. And he loves bones, sleeping and eating. And his signature, I just draw, uh, draw his paw. So this is his uh, passport. I thought it would look really cute in his uh, suitcase. So let me put this um, back here. 
So this all goes in here and there is room for journaling if you want to. And I will look what I do with it. And here is a little pocket that comes off. Oh, sorry. And it's really, really tiny. But there are also, um, is it focusing? It's not focusing very well. So here are some uh, telegram where you can put something in it. Just a little pocket. And that goes, um, yeah, right on this pocket here. Just with a little um, clasp. Like this. So this is the inside and on the other inside I will take my um, suitcase and lay it down for a moment. So this is the inside of the suitcase actually and I, um, I made a little mini album in it. Hey everybody, Marley again, uh, my camera cut off so um i left off to show you the inside of this suitcase and here is the mini album inside and you can uh, take it out of course and this is the inside pretty simple just some uh bulbs rows and here are some uh bottles with some pearls and some of them with ink dropping out and a pen nib from uh, tim holtz so this is the inside, not really um, very special, but the mini album, I will take it here and put the suitcase away, sorry for the noise. So this is the mini album, let me zoom in and you can see it here. This is the, um, the spine. And I hope you can see it well, but here is some beautiful um, rosette trim from Gisela, who is lavish lace to see on YouTube. And here is a beautiful articate charm with the Eiffel Tower on it. I thought that would suit really well with this, uh, with this travel project. So here I've used lots and lots of Prima flowers. Those are from the Romance Novel Collection here. Here are some gears and some more roses and gears and some prima marketing embellishments here this one says memories and i um it's from recollections and i got this from bonnie thank you bonnie and hey bonnie we need to catch up soon and here are some gears and some beautiful trim and um the sides i did some um how do you call it front touch again to give it a vintage look. Here is a beautiful piece that is from uh, Scrap Unlimited 2 with a nice bubble in it. Here is um, a ticket. Oh, there is a hair hanging down. A ticket and some uh, a beautiful butterfly that's from uh, the Romance Novel Collection 2. Some more postage stamps. And this is the back side. I will show you this one too. Just uh, paper and some uh, front touch again. So this is the front, let me lay it down and it's um, here are the first pages. This one is pretty clean, I need to fill it up with journaling and um, here I just put some um, flowers, let me pick it up actually. Here is um, a journal tag with a beautiful butterfly on it. Here's some more room for journaling and there is a little um, pocket here inside that you can pull this memory of out. And here is a little tag with um, a clock piece and this is the first page with Mr. Wilson. Here is a handmade doily made by my mom, some swirls, some ziva swirls, some beautiful flowers and a perfect day that is cut out from the Romance Nova collection. Here is the picture on the beach. So this is the first page, well the first scrap page. And here is another one. 
and I've put some um, oh sorry some wood pieces from Prima some more Prima marketing flowers some Ziva swirls and a picture from Mr. Wilson again and I created this whole album with um, photos of him of in the beach here we see he's barking again so I will close the door because he won't stop hold on for a minute guys sorry so here um, is a cluster of flowers some postcard and here is a hot air balloon that I cut out and it's actually a die from um, Whimsy Whimsy stamps here is a little telegram that you have to hold on like this and here is a little owl that is from the Mod Podge molds and here is some room for um, journaling so you can and here is another a spot for journaling and here um, on this page you can still hear him barking so sorry guys here is another page here is a Prima marketing uh, bird, some swirls and another cluster of flowers, some more Ziva swirls and um, here I cut out a little tag and you can pull um, some tags out so there is um, more room for journaling, just some simple tiny tags that says message and here is another one and I've put some twine on it so you can pull them out because it's really really tiny it's from the 6x6 six six, um, block so this is the other page another page on the beach so here are some swirls some beautiful handmade flowers here is a little um, prima metal piece some more flowers and swirls here is a little um, pocket and you can um, let me grab this album again so you can pull it out and there is a little um, journaling spot right here so you can pull it back in here and here are some pearls and here is another tag with a Prima marketing camera and another swirl and here is another page of Mr. Wilson with a doily made by mom and I just cut out beautiful and some flowers this page is really um, simple I'm oh, sorry for that and this is the last um, page I've put some uh, lace behind the photo a beautiful corner from Scrap Unlimited another flower from Prima some swirls and this big piece it was a wood piece that says love and I just glimmer misted it and put some stamps on it and some swirls and I got that from Bunny too thank you Bunny and this is the bag of the album really simple so this was actually the little mini album hope you like it so that goes right back in the suitcase like this and yeah that was pretty much um, my project and you can find more pictures of it on um, on Facebook and on my blog I will put the link to my blog and Facebook um, below in the description box hope you enjoyed this project and I hope to see you guys soon again because I really miss being on um, on YouTube hope we can catch up soon bye bye